On the 19th of August 2023, seven brave motorcyclists made their way to the Super Sausage Cafe on the A5 near Toaster for a meeting of minds. Ice Didi, the all-year motorcyclist, Solo Moto UK, Ainsworth Rider, Silver Fox Travels, The Adventures of Gloria, and Ian Hughes. This is the story of one man's quest to attend what would later become known as Vlogfest 2023. Afternoon all. Well, today we're loading Clementine in the van because she's going on some more jollies. And we're going down to uh, near Silverstone to meet up with some other YouTubers. So here we are at home and we're going to put Clementine in and uh, hopefully not make a complete arse of it. Right, she's in. So uh, we'll see you on the road. Bye for now. Morning, all. Here we are, just joining the motorway. Silverstone for the meat. Continue on M6. So uh, we'll bring you back in later on. Probably halfway through. Cheers now. Here we are, there's Clementine and uh, Bob, there's Anne, and there's the services. Right, gonna grab a brew, catch you in a bit, bye. Well, we got here, we're at the uh, at Blue Bell Cottage at the old tractor barn. There we go. and uh, close to an airfield anyway got to get uh, Clementine out of the van now right bear with us Right, so there we are, we're all ready for Saturday, 
sorry if you saw uh, mostly my bum but uh, hey ho right so next time you'll see me is on the road going to the super sausage <laughs> bye for now right morning all very gravelly drive this like riding on sand right leaving Bluebell Cottage and uh, are you with me? yep yeah. heading to uh, the Super Sausage uh, to meet up with fellow YouTubers I'm hoping that the camera's set right because I had a bit of a, a moment with it when I test rode the um, Hunter it was a bit low so hopefully it's alright now but I'm not sure anyway uh, first off uh, apologies for not uh, being active since um, since leaving Wales uh, numerous reasons for that uh, chiefly the weather has been atrocious and then uh, we went uh, camping with the awning um, which which was it, there's nothing wrong with the awning uh, at all it's it's perfectly fine very big and everything else um, but the only thing that was wrong with it was the two people that were in it. Um, yeah, we're too old for that lark. So uh, we've packed it away, it's in its bag and everything else, so that'll be going on YouTube, uh, YouTube on uh, eBay uh, when we get home. Um, what else have we been up to? Um, uh, well, while we, while we were on holiday, we uh, I did manage to get out on the... Royal Enfield Hunter which I really enjoyed really good bike uh, I hope you enjoyed that video uh, what else has happened oh yes um, hopefully uh, I won't have a mass exodus from my channel um, but it was time to let Honor go so Honor my Interceptor 650 has been sold and gone to a new home in Yorkshire. Uh, hopefully, the chap will look after her. He seemed a nice chap, so. Uh, and I was originally going to get uh, another bike, something a bit, uh, a bit more refined, a bit quicker. Um, but after the uh, after our awning holiday. Uh, I've kind of changed changed the mind on that so um, we're going to be getting a, a small caravan so we're reverting back to pan A uh, and getting a small caravan so. yeah yeah so hopefully like I say all the uh, Interceptor fans won't be uh, leaving me uh, we'll still be doing similar antics, but what it means is that you see originally we thought we could we could get by with doing holiday cottages and the likes, but they're proving to be rather expensive. Um, like for three nights stay in a holiday cottage, we could get two weeks in a in a, a camping or caravanning. So uh, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. we've been up to um, oh not really I haven't got me right I must have knocked my mirror when we put uh, Clementine in the van it's not quite set right 
Um, I hope you like the uh, intro to this video. The uh, loading up of uh, Clementine into the van and then unloading and a few bits in between. Uh, yesterday we went to, uh, yeah I suppose you could say we cheated by uh, coming down in the van and staying at a holiday cottage. Uh, but I come, uh, the thought of riding all the way from uh, uh, home to here, two, over 200 miles was, nah, uh, I wasn't, wasn't going to do that. Uh, anyway, so we came down Thursday and then yesterday uh, Anne and I went to uh, National Trust property close by, um, Cannon Ashby, Cannon's Ashby. Really nice, really enjoyable. I really like that kind of thing. Uh, it was a nice house and everything, but the downstairs, you know, like where the cooks and servants were, that was really interesting. And then uh, had a walk around the gardens, had a bit, of, had a bit of nosh. Very nice. This road isn't the most interesting, is it? The uh, A43. Uh, I could have taken a different route actually, I was looking at Google Maps um, but there's a, there was a hell of a lot of uh, turnings and you didn't, really didn't want to miss the turnings um, and I, I haven't got any facility to put a map, you know, a map or whatever on here so uh, maybe one of them beelines might be a good idea at some point Or, or I'll try and just mount something to have my uh, phone holder in and then I, as you know I write it down on a bit of paper in the phone holder I think I need to be in that lane so here at Toaster, Toaster I think it's pronounced Oh, another thing I went, I went to the uh, optician, uh, my op, op, eye appointment, ophthalmology, and uh, um, yeah, they've uh, come to the conclusion that the, uh, laser treatment didn't work because my pressures had gone uh, high again. Which is fine, I haven't got a problem with taking my drops. Because uh, the last two months my eyes have been really tired and just been bloody knackered all the time. Very on Clementine. Uh, yeah, so I'm back on the drops. Um, but what I have noticed and what they noticed as well is that my eyesight has uh, deteriorated somewhat. So when we get home I'll have to book an appointment another eye test, more expense, more bloody glasses. Oh, I've been through here many many moons ago. I was uh, seeing a girl that lived down, well went to move down to live in uh, Windsor and Slough, we're all around there. And I used to go down leaving Nantwich about six o'clock in the morning on my Z650 and then buzzing down there can't remember what time I got there, it was late obviously.
the meeting time is 11 o'clock. I might be a bit early. This wall is familiar. Well, you know what my memory's like, but... Uh, Oh, I think this might be it. Yeah. Here we go. Super sausage calf. Right. There's one or two of them there already, I think. So uh, I'll sign off now, and uh, we'll catch you in a bit. Morning. Hello. Hello. Right, we're going for a little bimble, the YouTuber's bimble, uh, Andy from uh, the Adventures of Gloria game as well. Had, uh, had a good chin wag there and, uh, and now we're just going to a brewery in to Toaster I think we've left uh, Silver Fox behind better catch them up the famous team
Toaster Mill Brewery. Afternoon all. This is the uh, end bit really I suppose of the uh, the meetup of the uh, YouTube vloggers. I've gone down this one way bit here. Enough. That was a really really good meet. Enjoyed that immensely. Yeah, that was a thoroughly enjoyable day. Having a good chin wag. Uh, so I think there's going to be some more meeting ups going on. A43 hope you enjoyed this uh, I really enjoyed the day and uh, please like comment and subscribe and uh, we'll see you on the next one bye now as uh, as I was going past uh, past the door thought of just to come and take a photo of Clementine at uh, Silverstone. It looks quite busy. I hope I can park where I want to park. Gonna be a quick photo and dash. There we go, just a bit of added footage there for you. 